Hey, it's Mike Moore. I made another weapon today. This time it's a katana. Now, hear me out here. It's not just... I know everybody's making katanas. There's like over a hundred of them on the Skyrim Nexus, and there's already like three or four on the Fallout 4 Nexus. But you know what I'm doing? I, I, I did it something a little different. I made a tactical katana. I just figured I'd jump on the bandwagon with everybody else, though, and make a katana myself. But uh, I didn't want to just copy and paste, you know, the generic katana that you see in like every every anime ever. So I went ahead and made my own. It drops from Gunners and Raiders. It has 20 base damage and an electrical attachment, which adds 20% more damage. And it also gives you six different hilts to choose from. So there's orange, blue, gray, green, red, and, uh, and, and something else. Brown, brown, the default leather color. There's not much else to say about it, so we're going to go ahead and kill some things, and you guys get to see it in action. And I'll ramble. I guess that's what I do. I ramble. So you, dear viewer and or listener, may not be aware, but um, these 13 mods that I have up on the Nexus, they're the only models I've ever created for any game or anything like that. And uh, obviously my first models, the, the Dedeo and the Chinese, not the Chinese officer sword, the 1942 swords, they're uh, pretty low quality in comparison to the newer stuff I've made. So I'm... I'm progressively getting better, and I think I'm going to go back to the older weapons soon, and then redo them, just because I want them to look prettier, I want them to have better textures. Texturing is a big thing that I've gotten better at, because when I started out, I was just like, ooh, look, there's a metal texture on the internet, I'll just paste it into the file, and there's the texture for my sword. And that, that obviously doesn't look very good if you look back on my old mods. But, um, anyway, yeah, uh, the, the end goal after I've finished fixing up all my old weapons, is adding them all into a big pack. And not only adding them into a pack and merging the leveled lists, but adding unique versions of each weapon and adding locations for each weapon, each unique weapon anyway. So you can go into a dungeon and find a unique version of the fire axe, or you can find an ice pick in a refrigerator, or you can find a katana in some kind of... Um, old military base that'd be cool i don't know i haven't i haven't worked out something for everybody yet but uh but i, I want to make it more than just a weapon pack you know i want to i really want to make dungeons dungeons are fun every single open building in the wasteland that i walk by that has nothing in it it's just like a, a blocked off door that just gets me excited because that's like an opportunity to make a new a new building or a new dungeon like it might not just be a building that you walk into and there's a first and second floor and there's some skeletons around a bed no what if what if the bottom of the building is just torn out and it just leads into this giant cave system and in that cave system it's just full of this this terrible ghoul menace that wants to kill you and at the end you get a fire axe because fire axes are fun to kill ghouls with uh, anyway, yeah, you, you've you seen the sword in action, and I've rambled. We've hit all the markers for a successful Mike's Moore video, so I think we're all set to go here. If you want to keep an eye on me, or you want to keep an eye on the mods I'm making, I think I'll make a new, a new series soon that'll be not so much just me showcasing a mod, but it'll just be some gameplay with me talking over top. And I don't want to just saturate everybody's subscription feed with videos. I don't want to publish like, oh, one or two videos every day, you know, more videos means more subscribers. Like maybe, maybe that is true, but I, I don't know. I don't want to quality over quantity, you know what I mean? So I'll probably do it like once every Sunday or something like that. And uh, if you're interested in that, go ahead and hit that little, well, it used to be a little red button. I don't know what it is anymore. It's probably gray. Hit, hit the subscribe button is what I'm going for. I would appreciate it. And, uh, Leave a comment too. I like I like talking to you guys. With that said, I think I'm all done. So you go ahead and enjoy the rest of your day and I'll probably enjoy mine if I don't drive myself insane doing more texture work because it's it's literally hell. I hate it. But I do it for you guys because I love you. Like the I pre I appreciate you.